what's going on guys it's your boy terabyte reacts here and we are starting a new new series on this channel a read through of manga this is going to be my first time so if i don't do it very well give me a pass please because this is the first time i'm ever going to do i've read um out loud to people before um never been in a book club or anything like that but you know i've done I've read stories to people before. And I'm a really dramatic person. You know, I like to kind of act out what I'm seeing. But in the case of this, definitely I can't act out what I'm seeing. But I'm definitely, I know myself and I know I'm the type of person that when something exciting has happened, you can definitely see it on my face. Like, I can go bl ballistic. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, uh, I'm a very gyrating person you know so i know myself so expect a lot expect a lot um of course it's my first time as i said before um the way how i'm going to be doing this i'm going to explain it it's going to be really simple guys um i'm going to be uploading this to youtube in an edited form um but the panels won't be showing so the way how you're going to experience it on youtube is not the same way you're going to experience it on the google drive i'm going to be uploading this google drive and though it's going to kill the google drive because these videos are going to be super long um so in terms of those kind of uploads i'm probably going to try to do um a couple of volumes or a couple of chapters or something like that because you guys said these these chapters these volumes they're really long so as we go along, I will decide where to end my reactions, as in end the read-throughs for that week. Um, I'm not going to leave that up to y'all. <laughs> I can't leave it up to y'all. So, on YouTube, I'm going to block out the panels. And if you want to see the panels, you know, you can go to the Google Drive and you can watch it with the panels. Okay? So, if you don't want to... If you... I'm still going to be uploading the video to read through on youtube but it's going to be blocked out okay and it's going to be later too because i have to edit that video um on the google drive is still going to be edited as in going through through the parts where you know the whole thing is going to be there it's going to be the full read through but it's going to be some editing of course because i'm just recording everything but i don't want there to be any lull or anything like that in between where there's no enjoyment or stuff like that but story wise everything that i read is going to be there so just to let you guys know how the things are going to go that's why i explained that now when it comes on to bit shoot i might upload upload it to bit shoot i'm not entirely sure if i'm going to be doing doing that but if it does present the opportunity for me to do that then i will but for now we're just gonna stick to youtube um youtube the panels are gonna be it's gonna be blocked out so i'm basically just gonna block out like um some of it so that the entire panel is not shown we'll see how it is i might just blur it to see how that works like blur it out to see how that works or you know what I'm saying? Or just block the entire thing. So I'm going to be testing a couple of ways to see how this works first. Um, I don't even know if I can have this on the screen right now because that's actually um, the first panel, the first thing on there. So I don't even know if I can have that while I'm talking to y'all for this intro. So we'll see how things go. So let's just go and jump into this, man. I'm excited. You guys said this is one of the best mangas of all times best um drawn um manga so i'm ready i'm excited you guys said this is way better than the anime so let's just go jump into it man and see what this is all about so i will see you guys over there make sure you go and check it out whether it's on google drive whether it's on bitroot whatever as you, as i said it's going to be uploaded without the panels on youtube of course so let's do this man it's a lot of uploading so let's <laughs> So let's get to it.
All right, so we have Berserk here, man. Let's 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 jump into these panels. Yes. All right, so we got the first. We get the, the author is Kentaro Miu, Mi, Mi, Miura. <laughs> Kentaro Miura. Miura. All right, Berserk. So we got him hanging. Is he hanging? Got a lot of cuts on you, buddy. All right, so this one is called The Black Swordsman. So there's three... Ch there's, it seems like there's three chapters in this volume one right here. So I'm, I'm going to try to get through this whole volume. I'm going to try to get through all 167 pages of this one. But let's just see how it goes because I might just stop at just um, chapter two because it seems like this is chapter two. This is chapter three, right? So let's jump in. Ooh. Well, goddamn, this is how we go. We just going to start it out with what's going on here. Damn, just off the bat. I like how detailed it is, though. This this look like some hentai comics, ain't it? <laughs> this like, look like some hentai comics right here. Um. So we got. OK, so we giving her the business. All right. Giving her the business right there. Whoa, why is she turning as she was screaming yes, but now she's, what is she, a succubus? Whoa, 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 bro. Nah, 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 we have, wait a second here. What are you guys, what, what did you guys get me into, man? What is she, a succubus? I didn't know this was going to be about, like, you know, some extraterrestrial activity or some demon shit? I didn't know that. All right. I'm down. All right, let's go. All right, so the Black Swordsman. Okay. So she says, um, you fell into my trap, fool. So, okay, so she was trying to trap him. So I guess that's what succubuses do. Um, so this is your last taste of heaven before I send you to hell. All right. But he replies... Hold on a second. Is that her still? Wait a minute. Did he put his hand in her throat? What? The only one trapped is you, bitch. Okay. He put his hand down her throat, bruh. Did he kill it? Oh, he's out. He's like, let me put on this fly-ass jacket right here and dip. Okay, so it looks like they're showing what happened. I can't. I can't really tell based on that panel right there. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what he did. Is that... Did he take it, her head off? Oh, that's crazy, man. Man, just put on his jacket and dip. Didn't even say shit. He's like, I'm out this piece. Okay, so... We in a different place here now. Got that panel. So they they... Riding into the city with their carriages, and we got, what is that? Oh, is that him in the black coat right here? I'm guessing that's him. So we got some in some new characters, somebody in some weird old knight knight armor. Um, so we got him. Oh, okay, so that's him in that black coat. So I'm gonna look out for that black coat when I see panels and the the sword sticking out, because that's how I'm gonna recognize who this guy is. So, okay. And he got that metal arm too. Okay, so we got um so we got some some um slaves. Cause look, they look like slaves. They look like they're in some sort of prison of some kind or they, but they're riding on like a they look like they're in a cage. Okay. So okay, so they in here they're in some sort of establishment right here. Okay, so somebody looked like somebody threw a sword. Damn. Oh, you missed. Did he throw it at? Whoa, bro. What is going on here? Were they, pr they using somebody as target practice in here? Okay. Okay. Okay, so it was, what is this, a fairy? Okay, so what? I'm, from what I'm understanding is that the story is about, like, um, maybe some demonic forces they got this looks like a fairy or a elf maybe i don't know so let, let's keep going so it has that kind of 
feel to it. You get what I'm saying? So it's like a um, a magical society or something like that in, in some way. So he says, stop squirming around. How am I supposed to hit you? Okay, I'm guessing these guys are bad guys. Okay, I feel sorry for that elf. I feel, okay, so it is an elf. See what I'm saying? So so it is an elf, because I was thinking fairy, but it could be an elf. Okay, so I feel sorry for that elf. There's nothing we can do about it. Somebody else say. Y'all could try something. I mean, y'all just sitting there watching them torture the elf. You know what I'm saying? So, so somebody else said, not even the Lord Mayor can lay a hand on the men of Coca Castle. So they're from Coca Castle. Okay, best not to get involved. Hey, okay, so they're, they're lining up the next one over here. Hey, hey, here comes the next one. Okay, so we're at, um, if you're following in uh, on your own, like on a site on your own, guys, if you're following on your own, um, then I'll probably tell you guys, update you guys on what page I'm on. But if you're following, you'll see. If you're following, if you're watching on YouTube, guys, please... Please, I'm begging y'all to please, please follow on a on a site or something if you don't want to go and watch it with the panels or whatever. And you just want to watch it on YouTube. Go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna mess your shop a bit. We're on we're on page 13 right now. So I'm gonna mess up your shop a bit, huh? So he takes what is that? Looks like a crossbow. So that's a crossbow right there. He said, I'm going to mesh up your shop a bit. Is he going to do something about these dudes? So the elf, looked like the elf got mad. I said, bring it on, fathead. Why don't you untie me? Sorry about that. Bring it on, fathead. Why don't you untie me? I'll gnaw right through your arteries. Oh, so you got that bite work. Okay. I'm going to stuff those words right back down your throat. St now, stop wiggling. That big, fat, bald-headed dude. <laughs> no. He's like, why? No, 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 no. Um. Okay. Whoa! Bro! This dude is not playing around, bruh. Headshot. Headshot to the head. He's down. Definitely down. I'm glad he went first. So, <laughs> look at the elf's face. Like, what happened? Like, they're, they're still sitting there. So, they're like, Igor. Okay, so that's the fat guy's name, I'm guessing. It's like, Igor. Bastard. Who the hell... Bang, bang, bang. He fired more arrows. Ooh. Bro. Took out two of them. Took out the other two. The one with the armor and the other one. Why didn't the eye, bro? Oh, my God. This dude is a savage. He does not give two shits. <laughs> you better run back to Coca Castle. You better run back to Coca Castle. Ah. So this dude, is, they all say ah. People covering their heads. Dude standing over there like a boss. Okay. So he reloading, bruh. He re dude. You better be out. Fairy the um the elf is still there. Um everybody's standing around looking like what the hell is going on? This dude pulled his sword out. What are you doing? This dude just took out your compadre, your compadres. They just took out your nakamas, bro. <laughs> they just took out your friends. And you still sitting here? Bro, you supposed to be out. You gave him time to reload and you still, st bro, pu pu pull out a sword in an arrow fight. You ain't that nice. You guys from Coca, Cas Coca Castle, it's dumb, bro. Come on. He put it, push it through his nose. Push it through. He, okay, so he got shot in the nose. <laughs> he got a nose ring. Damn! He said, Gah. He's crying. 
He's like, all right, dude, grab the arrow in his nose, bro. This dude is a straight up savage already. I love his character. I already love his character. Let's go. That's gotta hurt. Damn, the, the elf is is holding his nose. I don't know what gender it is, so I'm not I'm not gonna assume. The elf holding his the, the nose. You're one of the thugs. For, so our character now is talk. I, I don't know what the character's name is because nobody has said his name. You're one of the thugs from Coca Castle, aren't you? So the guy's like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Damn, he must be in some serious pain right now. So, so he's like, answer me. And he's like, yes, sir. All right, then I suppose you can deliver a message to your boss. Oh, so he knows who they are. Okay, what message? The black swordsman has come. Ooh, that intro though. Where's your, tell your boss I'm coming. Tell him the black swordsman is here. I want that work. Let's get it. I want that smoke. Let's get it. That's all. That's all. The black swordsman. Oh, his eyes open wide when he hear, when he heard that. Ooh, behind you. Oh, so the, hel the elf is warning our character here he pulls the sword and oh my god did he pull out some a soul or something is that still his coat right here I'm wondering if that's his coat okay oh da damn what bro who is this guy he just got Fatality. <laughs> Whoa, bro. That is one seriously big sword, though. But, oh, my God. And I love the details in these panels, man. We're not playing around around here. Oh, my God. Look at this, man. Took his whole torso off. Oh, my God. Oh, it's like, oh, you know, you know, the nut bust face all around the whatever the 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 um the bar or whatever they want to call it there. Oh my god, look at this man. Look at that. I love how detailed that is. Mm. <clears throat> Straight gore. So everybody's standing around, the elf eyes wide open, and then they show the sword with the blood on it. It was much too big to be called a sword. <laughs> oh man. I guess that's what she said. <laughs> Massive, thick, heavy, and far too rough. Indeed, it was like a heap of raw iron. Oh, my God. That sword is beastly, though. Look how long this thing is, man. And he's wielding it like it's nothing. Look at that. Look at that, man. The thing almost touched the ground, bro. Look at that. Down to his ankles. That's crazy. For a sword to be that long, bro. Okay, so he said, I'm counting on you. So he's still talking to the dude from Coca Castle that he let live to send a message. Okay, so the elf says, excuse me. Hey, wait a second. Don't leave me here. He's like, ah, oh, man. Okay, so the elf got out of the ropes. And now is following him. Hey, wait up. Listen. If you're going to save someone, you don't just leave him tied up like that. <laughs> I don't think he wanted to save you. He just happened to have, um, he just happened to be coming along and you was just being harassed by these people. I don't think he meant to save you. You're supposed to follow it through to the end, you know. Say, that's quite a sword you got there. Or should I call it a slab? Okay, a slab. Never heard anybody call a sword a slab, but okay. Still no answer. Oh, yeah, I'm Puck. Nice to meet you. Your name is weird. <laughs> you see, I was in a troop of traveling performers, but we were attacked by some by those bums. Since then, I've been locked up in a minor bird's cage and soaked in a wine bottle. It's a wonder I'm still alive. That's for sure. 
The town was also attacked a number of times, but the Lord Mayor made a deal with the thugs. In exchange for tribute, they promised that they'd leave the town free and there'd be no more raids. Okay. The town was attacked by a number of times, but the Lord Mayor made a deal. Oh, so the, the mayor made a deal. And in exchange for tribute, they promised that they'll leave the town free. Okay. So, but after this, I guess they'll start attacking again because he he messed them up. So they'll start attacking again. You know, if I were you, if I were you, I'd get out of town fast. Did you see what this guy just did to you telling this guy to get out of town? Bruh. Come on, man. We are talking about manga characters here. <laughs> I mean, if they catch you, they'll cut you to pieces. This guy's out here killing succubus. I don't think he's afraid of a couple of thug, a couple of thugs, you know. So, and it's not just the thugs either. Now that the Lord Mayor has packed, has a pact with them, even the town guards, even the town guards, guards would come. Yo, did he just? <laughs> he just smacked her off. He's like, you're talking too much. <laughs> So, he's like, ow. Oh, he hit her, he, he hit it on the butt, or whatever it is. I don't know if it's a he or she, I, I have no idea, because he, it has no genitals, so I can't tell. So, <clears throat> the elf is like, ow. That hurt. What do you do, what you do that for? So, he's like, don't touch me. I'll squash you. Elf is like, what? What is it with you? A person shows you a little concern and you respond with that stuck up attitude of yours. Because he's not there to save you, bro. Ooh. The army showed up already. So the elf is like, see, I told you. Well, gotta go. Oh, <laughs> the elf just dips, bro. It's like, I'm out. <laughs> so, dude is like, damn. Oh, so they took him. Oh, so that's how we end up in this position. Okay, so they cap, so they captured him, arrested him, or whatever. Took all his swords. So it seems like they're um, they are um, <clears throat> torturing him. So yeah, a stubborn bastard. You know that it's, it's like you're they have a funny way of depicting English in this anime. It's like it's gonna be kind of hard to read it sometimes because some of the stuff I'm not gonna be. Um, so he's basically saying you are like they join the two words together, you and R, and say, You're <laughs> you're a stubborn bastard, you know, ain't you even gonna make a little noise? Ain't you they uh, nobody talks like that. <laughs> Ain't you even gonna make a little noise? But we do talk like that. But it's like you read the proper thing improper. It's never like you write improper to read improper. You know what I mean? So ain't you even gonna make a little noise? No, because I'm a badass, dude. What what are you talking about? What you're doing ain't torture. Uh so um I don't know what he did. Did he spit in his face? It seems like it. it seems like he spit, he spit blood on him, it seems. So he said, you bastard, the guy that's torturing him. It's, so somebody comes in and they say, stop. That's enough for now. And he says, my lord. And the guy's like, are you going to question me, bitch? I said, stop. <laughs> okay, so that stockpile, that stockpile of weapons. Forgive my accent, guys, because sometimes when I'm trying to to talk a certain way i mess up words okay so that stack stock pot that stock pile <laughs> of weapons it belongs to this man what yes oh so he's asking him a question if the weapons belong to the mat to to the to our guy here so he says yes lord mayor enough weapons to start his own war crazy bastard this dude walks around with so many weapons, it's nuts. Look at the amount of weapons on the table here. That's that's crazy. Okay, so we have... So it's like, you are a mercenary. 
you are a mercenary. And he still doesn't answer them. He's like, the so mayor is like, a complete stranger to these parts. You've done a terrible thing. Do you have any idea what you've done? He's like, because you murdered those men, this town may very well be destroyed. Okay, so they're still worried about the men from Coca Castle. So are you telling me that those guards standing there are scarecrows? <laughs> they can't do shit. They it's like what? He's like what? Enough. One of the guards says what? And the mayor shuts him down. It's like enough. He's like, you have no idea how horrible he is, the ruler of those men. So he's still worried about this dude. Oh my god, they show the image of him. He he rides on a on a horse. Look like an armored horse. Uh, he looks he looks vicious. He's got a cobra head. Well, it's always nice to wear <laughs> to wear nice things, I guess. He that thing is beyond human. It's something horrible and incomprehensible. A creature from the very depths of the pit. Wow. No one can kill him. At least not anyone human. So he's like, I see. So that's why you made your dirty deal with him. So the mayor holds him now. He's like, how could you understand a wandering vagrant like yourself? I understand. So so the guy, uh, all right, so our guy is like, I understand. I know all about it. How he's a monster that eats human flesh. I know it very well. <laughs> so they're like, ah, oh, you know the nutless face and all that. <laughs> And I know that you continue to provide him with his meals. I passed them at the gates of the city. A prison wagon full of women and children. Yeah, I remember that. The mayor's like, I, 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 I am the mayor. It is my duty to protect this town. And our guy's like, protect this town. He's like, protect this town? Don't you mean protect yourself? He's like, the mayor's like, you, you, ah! <laughs> So he's like healing. Look like he's having a heart attack. What? He's like, they're all like, my lord. My dude is laughing. <laughs> so the man is like, do it. Torture him as much as you like. I don't care. But don't kill him. We still have to hand him over to Coca Castle alive. All right. So I guess we're going to get to see dude from Coca Castle. Okay. So dude is. The mayor walks out, so he's like, prepare my carriage immediately. I'd best go to Coca Castle myself and beg for forgiveness. Damn, they mad scared of this dude. Damn, is 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 he a, um, a E.T.? <laughs> is he a demon or something? Damn. So they're like, so they went to report as like the black swordsman, you say. He's like, yes, Baron. So I'm guessing they refer to him as Baron. Okay. So who's... Which one of them is it? This You have this guy that's here. So, they're like, his sword was so big, it towered over him. And he split Dean in half with one stroke. He dressed all in black and had a false arm made of iron. A real shady looking guy. He's like, could it be? Oh, damn, this dude really has shark teeth. <laughs> wow, he may just be badass, too. So he's like, could it be him? Okay, so I guess they know who it is. Okay, they're like, my lord. He's like, what is it? I guess this is his armor. I'm wondering if this is just his armor just sitting down here. And nobody is because I was a little confused why this thing was just sitting here because this is supposed to be the the guy the Baron's armor right uh, so I'm wondering if the armor is just sitting there when they come to report my lord what is it that wretch the mayor is waiting at the castle gate he requests an audience with you about the recent incident he's like I see I don't have many voices so you're just gonna have to know what it is <laughs> It's been okay, so the mayor comes in. So the baron is like, It's it's been a while, mayor. How good of you to come. He's like, 
So he swallows, you know. And he's like, Your Lordship, I have come to ask for your forgiveness for this recent transgression. This was the act of a vagrant who is unf unfamiliar with our ways. There is no connection to any of the town's folks. Okay, so... So he's like trying to make another deal. I'll give you double the amount of prisoners and gold from now on. So please. So Baron is like, you look troubled. <laughs> like, eh? Unlike before, you're now worried about losing your own life, aren't you? Aren't you, Mayor? Bro, is that an ear? What? Wait a second, did he just... Bro, so this guy really does eat human flesh? So he just throws him an ear from his dish? He, it was an ear on the fort, bro. What? Bro, this dude really does eat human flesh? So the mayor even steps back. He's Okay, so, so the baron gets up. He's like, gold, prisoners, I don't care about such things. All I wish to see are humans within a fiery apocalypse trying to escape. So it was his armor. His armor was just sitting there. That's kind of weird. I'm, <laughs> that's really weird that you have your armor just sitting there like like somebody's in it. Um, so he's like, all I wish to hear is the sound of snapping bones crushed under the hooves of horses. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I don't even need an excuse. None at all. Are we going to get our first showdown, though? That's what I want to know. Okay, so we got the mayor. They escorted him out. So he's like, what are you doing? Let go of me. Let me go. My lord. My lord. Oh, so the baron's about to step out. Oh, he's like the black swordsman. I'm going to eat his nose. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I want some more ear in my soup. <laughs> so it's like, okay, so they threw out the black swordsman, stopped torturing him. So they threw him out. So he's like, where am I? Damn, I can't move. Ugh. <laughs> so he sees something, though. What is that? What is that? I don't know what that is. We're on page 41, guys, just to keep you guys up to date. We're on page 41. We're doing pretty good. Okay, so we have, what the hell is this thing, man? What is that? So he's, like, still in pain. This thing is creepy as hell. He's like, you again? Who is this? What do you mean? What do you mean, you again? We never met this thing before. So he still can't move, and he's like, get away from me. Get away from me. This thing looks like he's about to eat him or something. So something comes in. And kicks it away, it seems. I. Glug, glug. Okay, it seems like something. Oh! It's the elf came back. Oh, <laughs> the elf came back. Okay, so. God. What's with that all of a sudden? You scared the hell out of me. Hey, this water is kind of yellow. Don't tell me it's. P. <laughs> I guess it's P. <laughs> you from the tavern. So he's like, yeah, so he's calling out to the elf. Okay. Next panel here we got. He's still laying on the ground. He can't move. Why? I don't know. I mean, he, I mean, did he cut his legs off or something? Like, what is going on? He seems to be intact. So I don't understand why he can't move. Maybe they paralyzed him with something. I don't know. Have a. It's like, have a nightmare. So the elf is talking now. Have a nightmare? Wow, they really worked you over, didn't they? Well, rest assured, I gave that hegged guard a little something to sleep on. Okay, so he's dragging the keys. Okay, so he so it seems like the help the elf got some keys there, it seems like. And gave him something to give the um the guard something to sleep on. Okay. So he's still intact, as we can see, the black swordsman. Wow. Everywhere I look, you're covered in wounds. I told you you should have listened to my advice. What you? So he's like, what you coming here for? And the elf says to repay a debt. 
we elves have a strong sense of duty, of course. Hmm. So he's looking at his body, the elf. He said, hmm, now let's see. <laughs> and he's like, don't touch me. <laughs> don't you ever touch me. He's like, you're being a little bit ungrateful now, bruh. Came, saved you from whatever was about to eat your damn face. So the elf is like, the hell? I ain't going to do anything bad to you. I can understand why he's not so trustworthy. I, I do understand that. So elf is like, look at yourself. You're in no position to give me that kind of attitude. Now be quiet and let me handle it. And he's still like, he's still like, stop so i don't know what the hell the health is doing right now some weird stuff coming off of the body seems like the elf got healing powers maybe um so flapping the wings some weird stuff coming off all right so he's like the pain it's disappearing so he's like we elves got all sorts of powers given usually elves in any story, they usually got, you know, some magical powers some way, somehow. So, that's 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 fine. It's like, we can heal wounds. We can sense people's emotions. We can even make people happy. Okay, that's, that's weird. <laughs> okay, so, or at least, that's what our troop leader said before he got his head cut off by bandits. <laughs> okay, so... Asking her his name again. Say, what's your name? Guts. <laughs> wow, what a name. Guts. I got guts. My name is Guts. And that's what I do. I have guts. <laughs> yeah, so his name is Guts. Finally, we learn what his name is. So the, so the, the, um, the elf's still talking. Why'd you come to this town? Anyhow, still not answering. So the elf continues to say, you don't have to answer if you don't want to. So she's still climbing on the body. So you see this weird mark on his body, like a branding, it seems like. And asking, what is that? This thing on your neck that looks like a crest or something. It seems like a brand. Like he was branded with something. Okay. So he gets up. He's like, what did I do this time? It's like, brand. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It seems like a brand. And he calls it the brand. Okay, so it hits the brand. Okay. So the elf is like, the brand? What's that? What's it mean? Why? How did why? How did it happen? Who did it to you? Yeah, usually you get you don't brand yourself. <laughs> so Guts is like, you talk too much. You know that? Like, huh? You'll find out soon enough. Pretty soon, he'll come here to kill me. Okay, so do these guys know each other? I'm wondering. I don't know. Maybe they do, need, do know, each, know each other. Okay, so as well as burn this whole town... To the ground. So he's going to kill you and then burn the town to the ground. So maybe they know off each other. Because the um the guy, the freaking, the, the, um, the Baron seems like he knows about Guts. Seems like, because he seems really excited. So, and he left because when hearing about him. So the elf is like, oh, does that mean it's those guys from coca castle okay so we got guts again still got his arm you you mean you're planning to drag the townspeople into all of this and he's like i don't care all i want to do is find that bastard and kill him i don't care about anything else wow Wow, he's, <laughs> he's a savage, real savage out here. So it's like, ah, anyone who dies because they get caught up in someone else's fight is small fry. Who doesn't have the strength to survive in the first place? Wow. It's like his emotions are pouring into me. 
my chest is burning. He's like, if someone can't live their life the way they please, they might as well die. And the elf is feeling all of his, his emotions. He's like, is it rage? No, it's not just that. It's rage, sadness, and fear. It's all mixed together so dark, and there's something even deeper than that. And they're wondering, in that case, what about when you saved me? <laughs> so he starts laughing. He's like, oh, you thought I was saving you. Ha ha. <laughs> he's like, idiot. Who do you think you are? Why would anyone save you to think I'd risk my life for a little bug? <laughs> he is dying of laughter. <laughs> and the health it hits him in the chin. He's like, what are you doing, you little? Ah, uh, it's crying. He's like, hey, wait. Where do you think you're going? Oh, he's still. I didn't even realize he was still in a cell. He's still in the cell. That's nuts. Because I was like, did they let him go? Because it seems like at first it seemed like he was in an open area. Like truthfully like it seemed like he was in an open area the way how the panel showed him it seems like it didn't seem like he was in a cell or maybe i wasn't paying attention properly but he's still in the cell the elf left so he's like damn what was that all about so he's like but he brought him the keys left the keys so it's up to him if he wants to leave i guess so why is he doing that to himself Is he opening a wound that he has or something? So he's like, ugh. What? So he like, why did the brand start bleeding? Or did he feed the thing? Feed, did he put blood? Because he took blood from a wound on his hand. Like, he looked like he opened an old wound or something with his hand. And then he put it on the, on the brand, right? And then he's like, I've been waiting for you. Okay, that's weird. But I guess I'll understand that later. And it's like, so the, the elf... They're showing the elf. Seems like, wow, they're already burning the town, bro. Wow. They're already burning the town, killing everybody in town, bro. They are massacring everybody in the town. Wow. This dude is over here eating. Wow. The Baron ain't playing a round my dude he's like whoa he's enjoying it too f is like that's not human so he's like charging his guys into battle well not really a battle it's more like a freaking genocide so charge burn everything to the ground oh my dude is ready he is here the black swordsman is here what is this man How is he here or, or, okay, so he's out, got his weapons back. Wait a minute, did he teleport to the damn town? What the, did I miss something? Okay, so it's under the corpse. So the, the elf spotted him and was like, guts. So he's on the battlefield taking out these these soldiers okay neck shots everybody screaming the black swordsman is here guts is on the scene he's taking out these dudes these dudes in armor he's headshotting everybody it's like what kind of crossbow is that he pulls out the sword Bro, 
he pulls out the sword and takes the horse's head off. It, dude, he cut through the horse and the dude, bro. What? What did you guys get me into, man? What did you guys get me into, man? Bro, he takes the horse and the freaking dude in one, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. I'm going to have to stop it right here at this panel for a second. And we'll continue into the next video. You know how Google Drive works. It takes too damn long to process videos that are too long. So I'll see you guys on the next one. And we are back. Mm. Look at this, man. Takes the he he cuts the horse. The got the he just went through the horse's head and just take body and everything. That's crazy. So we got Ia. Dude went flying, bro. If that doesn't scare you on the battlefield, I don't know what will. That sword is too powerful, man. Or Guts is too powerful. So the elf is like, he's so strong. That's crazy. So everybody's like, uh, Baron. <laughs> so the Baron comes on the scene. He's like, so you're the black swordsman. The one who's been hunting us apostles. Oh, so he knew he was coming for him. So he's been hunting his buddies. Okay. Okay. So he drops the sword. Did he drop his sword on the ground? So he's like, I don't know what you hope to accomplish. But to think that a mere mortal can oppose us? Well, he's been killing your buddies. So I, I think he has legit. <laughs> I think he's legit right now. But to think that a mere mortal can oppose us um, is pure folly. So he went, he's going up against them like, oh, so my dude pulls out, pulls out a cross. It looks like a modified crossbow because it looks like he can fire so many, so many arrows at once. And it looks like the, um, the box, this uh, on top of the crossbow here. I think this is the, the like the cartridge. This is the cartridge um, that holds all the arrows in it. Man, he fired at he fired at the Baron. The Baron dodges everything, bro. Wait a minute, did he get one on him, or did he go through what? He didn't dodge shit. He took all of them, even the ones in the eyes. What is going on here? Is this guy a demon? Oh, it knocked him off. Oh, he got murked. What? So the elf is like, he did it. All the soldiers standing around like, my lord. Feeling sorry for the baron after he got knocked off his heart or by like 20 arrows. Dude got up. Whoa. Whoa. He got up, bro. He is not down for the count. He took arrows in the eye, in the head. Bro, the elf the elf is shocked right now. He got up. He's all his even the soldiers are surprised, like what? Cause they thought he was down. So Guts reloads. I guess he knew that that would yo, he put more arrows into him, bro. Gave him another cartridge. Let's go. So Gus, Gus is just standing there. I'm wondering why he dropped the sword, though. So he's, like, walking towards dude. He's like, bruh, you ain't ready. Where did he go? So he can't. He comes around the corner. And he get What is that? A snake tail? Whoa. So the Baron is a snake? He must because how else or did he summon a snake? So the 
the elf is like guts the guts went flying bro he got hit by a freaking snake tail he's spewing up blood damn he landed on his back hard too he's like it's futile no matter how many bolts you shoot at me it's like it doesn't matter because i'm a snake so he's like, a mere human like you can't possibly kill me. Oh, so he is a demon, like, but he and has a snake form. But the head inside the snake head is creepy. <laughs> Just be a snake. Oh, he's a snake. Weird looking. Wow, but that whoa, that's a beastly form though. Let's give let's give the Baron some some um Let's give the Baron some props here. That's a beastly form, bro. That is a beastly form. Look at that. And the details, man. The details in the drawing. I can't give it more compliments, bro. It's just, it's wow. The details on that. That drawing is incredible. I don't like the head inside of the, the snake mouth, but okay. It's a man snake, okay? So, Baron is like, I am going to eat you. I am going to eat you alive, boy. Everybody is like, it's a monster. And the elf is like, is like, what is going on? I'm surprised that the elf would be surprised, though. Because, I mean, if you're an elf, you should know there's other monsters. I mean, you're not exactly, you know what I'm saying? You know, you're not exactly a main species around these parts. So, so everybody's like, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. But Guts is still down. They're like, come on, Guts, look up, up. What the hell are you doing? Damn, he gets hit again by the snake tail. Send him flying, spewing up blood again. Uh... Seems um, the elf is concerned about him. Goods. And um, damn, he gets hit again by the snake tail, bro. Baron is giving him that work right now. You should not have dropped your sword, sir. Why did you drop your sword to put arrows in him? I guess maybe the arrow, he has to use the arrows to bring out their true form or whatever. I don't know. Um, He's getting that work with that snake tail, though. So... It's like, oh, he's he's still breathing. So it's like, oh, still breathing, are we? Most humans would have had their organs crushed by the first blow and be quite dead by now. But it all ends here. So he's going in for the kill to kill Guts. And he gets it. What? He hits him in the back. And he's spewing up a lot of blood, left him bloody on the ground. The elf is like, Guts, no. And then he picks up Guts by one arm. He's like, weak. How pathetic humans are. You humans are nothing more than food. Nothing but morsels to fill our stomachs. You sh food should learn to act like food. And <laughs> that, um... Guts grabs him with the iron hand. What? What is that? Hold up. Wait a minute. Oh! Now I get it. So that's how he killed the succubus in the first panels. That's how he killed. Cause I was wondering what the hell he did to the to the succubus. So he puts the hand in the mouth, and there's a gun, bro, a gun. So he pulls. It looks like he uses his mouth to pull the trigger or whatever to set it off. And all oh, you see right here, if you can see right here. You see it the hand part of the, 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 the um thing drops down and he blasted him with that thing, bro. Oh my god, that must have took his whole head off. What? So he goes flying back 
Baron is in flames, bro. Flames. Oh! Now Guts is gonna pick up the sword. Oh, he picks up the sword and cuts him in half, bro. Come on! That's what I'm talking about, bro. He's like, yeah, let's get this, man. Cuts him in half, bro. Oh, my God. Intestines went flying everywhere, if that's what that is. Bro. Guts falls on the ground. He's like, Guts. Man, he got a certain kind of bloodlust about him, too. Look at him. Is he smiling? That rage, though. Oh, my God. Cuts him in half. He's not even getting up. <laughs> so the elf is like, ew, it's still alive. <laughs> so he's like, so Gut steps on his head. The head, because he was still alive after getting cut in half. Steps on his head. He's like, don't die on me yet. <laughs> Guts is like, don't die on me yet. Oh, my God. So he puts a bunch of arrows into the, the, the snake head. Oh, now you want to beg for mercy. You, you were talking all that shit about humans, huh? You was talking all that shit about humans. What about it that you're talking about? Now you're talking about stop, stop, please? No, we ain't about that. You were talking all that shit before. Now you about to get this work. It's like, didn't you say it? Doesn't matter how many bolts I shoot at you. Right. I'll, you can take all the arrows, right? So, Guts is talking to him now. So, he's like, must be rough being unkillable and all. <laughs> like you said, humans are weak. We die easily. But no matter how weak we are, even if we're being chopped to bits or stabbed to death, we still want to live. Okay. I'm going to give you a little taste of what it's like. Wow. So he's still putting arrows in him. Yo, he's sadistic, bro. Guts. Guts don't play games. He's like, I'm going to torture you, bro. I'm going to torture you. Since says you want to talk about how weak humans are. So, so Baron looks up at him and he's like, who are you? And he sees the brand on his neck. He's like, that, that, that mark, it's the brand of sacrifice. You are, you are the God Hand. Where are the five, he's like, where are the five members? Oh, shit, there's five members of the God Hand. Oh, so, okay, new information, I dig it. That is, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Where are they? It's not for apostles such as... Oh, so... Oh, so it's not... I thought I thought he was talking about... Um, That was kind of weird. That transition was weird. But this is not actually um, dude talking. This, so this is not... Guts, this is not um the Baron talking. I thought it was the Baron that was saying, you are the God Hand. And then he asked him, where are the five members of the God Hand? But this is actually Guts talking, the God Hand. So he cuts him off. He cuts him off and he's like, the God Hand. So this is Guts talking, the God Hand. Where are the five members of the God Hand? So he's like, that is, that is, ugh. So he shots him in the eye again. He was like, I don't know. I don't know where they are. It's not for apostles such as I to know. I'm telling you the truth. Damn, he put so many arrows in him. So um, Guts is like, take your time and savor it as your body is slowly burned to ashes. Wow. He's vicious, man. He's vicious, bro. Wait, please. I don't want to die. <laughs> oh, now you don't want to die, huh? Huh? He's like, wait. 
help me. <laughs> no, <laughs> the screams, the, the elf can't take it. The screams. Ah, man. Damn, and he just walks off like a badass. So detailed, man. Berserk. <laughs> oh, my God. End of chapter. Yes, sir. I love it. I love it. I love it. So far, so good. So, you know what I'm going to do, guys? This is what I'm going to do. Because that was like, how many pages did we just do, man? That's nuts. That is absolutely nuts, but it's great. But I'm going to stop here today. I'm going to stop here today, man, because that was a whole lot of freaking pages. I think it was like a hundred and something pages I just did, but it was great, man. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stop here for now. I'm going to stop here for now. I'm going to figure out how to upload this. And the next time I do this, I'm definitely going to do, I'm going to try to do the rest of the volume. Um, as I said, as we go along, I'm going to determine, depending on how long I'm recording and if I have something else that I have to go and do after the recording. If I have more time, then I'll do more. But for now, I think that's a lot because I think this video is going to be about an hour at least. So I'm definitely, definitely loving this, man. I'm definitely loving this. This shot right here is too good too good my friend this is too good too beastly oh my god i love you guys man i love you guys you guys have never never seemed to disappoint me when it comes on to these things man and i really do appreciate it i really really do man i really do appreciate it so thank you guys for tuning in man thank you guys for coming by wait wait where, where, where are you watching this whether it's on youtube and you decided to follow on your own as we were going through this this um this here or whatever um or you decided to go and watch me go through the panels on the google drive or on bit shoot whatever i really do appreciate you guys for coming over and i will be doing a review of this coming up so make sure if you're on the google drive make sure you go back and check out the review i'm gonna probably upload it separately i don't know yet or i'll just attach it on to the, to the actual reaction who knows? Time will tell, I guess. So thank you guys for, for coming by anyway, man. Hope you guys support this as much as you support anything else on this channel, man. It's great. Thank you guys for watching as always. And I will see you guys for the review.